by Elliot Foster Daniel Keenan lost his undefeated record on Saturday on a world title fight undercard. The former Dale Youth ABC amateur was shocked on points by Angel Emilov, exclusively live on ITV box office. Keenan, managed by Steve Goodwin, was beaten by the Hungarian at the SSE Arena, Wembley, on the same bill as George Grove's WBA Super Super Middleweight title defense against Jamie Cox in the World Boxing Super Series. The hometown man struggled to get into the fight, if truth be told and, after giving Keenan problems across the distance, it was Emilov who walked away with the decision by 39 points to 38 on the referee's scorecard. Also on the bill, Michael Lerwal scored his second win in four weeks. The undefeated 22-year-old cruiserweight moved to 43 KOs after leaving Thomas Lovruden needing medical attention in the second of four scheduled stanzas. Lawal, who was winning the fight with relative ease anyway, unleashed arguably the best punch of his career, a right uppercut to ensure that he would be victorious. Thankfully, after paramedics entered the ring, Rudin returned to his stool and his dressing room as Lawal had his hand raised. And Michael Devine got his 2017 campaign underway with a convincing points victory. The reigning Southern Area lightweight champion outpointed madman Michael Mooney over four rounds, with referee Howard Foster scoring the contest 40 points to 36 in favor of Chunky. In the opener, Chris Billumsmith began proceedings didnt waste any time, dispatching Serbia's Aleksandar Todorovic 11,141 within the first round. The Shane McWiggan-trained fighter extends his record to 20 after making his debut in Bournemouth last month. Meanwhile, Yusuf Kumari was rarely tested as he comfortably defeated fellow Brett Jamie Spade on points, Dean Richardson delivered a perfect punch performance as he made light work of Slovakia's Andrei Morovic, stopping the Slovakian with two seconds remaining in the second round and Kirk Garvey won his third straight fight since losing his undefeated record to Colin Farriker. Tags